Okay, well, we easily get the eigenvalues 0 0.1, 0 0.7. And I'll just tell you, because you can easily do it, your eigenvectors could be Two one and negative one one. Let's just check it out. If I multiply 0 0.9 by two, I get 1.8. If I multiply one by 0.2, I get 0.1, right? Or 0.2, and add those up, I get two. So the first row times this is two, which is going to match, right? In the second row is 0.2 and 0.8, which is 1, okay? And then negative 1 is going to give me negative 0.7, right? And 0.7, right? Yeah. Okay? So it's very easy. So this one has eigenvalue 0.7, this has eigenvalue 1. Okay. Now, diagonalize. And implicitly, we're diagonalizing this transition matrix. Okay. And I, I, you know, when I wrote these down, I wrote them down from memory with a question mark. I just wrote down the characteristic equation and factored it to verify. <laughs>